Hi everybody, this is Caleb Johnson. Today I'm going to show you exactly my routine on LinkedIn. This, like I said, this is a four series of social media that I'm going to show you exactly what you can do and what my routine is every single day on the four major social medias. Um, this one is LinkedIn. Um, we're going to be doing a video on Facebook, what I do on Facebook, my routine, and what's my routine on Instagram, and what's my routine on Twitter. Okay, so first off, this is LinkedIn. Now, what I'm going to show you on it, this is very powerful. Now, if you're a business owner, and you are, or if you're in network marketing, if you're not on LinkedIn, this is one social media that you definitely want to be in because I'm telling you right now guys at first when I got started in LinkedIn I was very intimidated I was just it looked overwhelming it was, it was just you know where do I start it looked even more complex than Facebook when I first got on Facebook but LinkedIn is actually where it is I'm telling you right now what I'm gonna show you in about a couple minutes well, a couple seconds. We're not gonna keep talking. In a couple minutes. What I'm gonna show you is all the activity, all this activity that's going on, on my LinkedIn page. I'm telling you right now, I have so much activity. I have a pretty much an eight-hour day of work of just following up with people, talking to people, people reaching out to me. I'm reaching out to people. It's just so much busy stuff that's going on in LinkedIn. It's actually overwhelming, and being overwhelmed with contacts and following up with people and people reach out to you it's good that means you never ever going to run out of people to talk to in your business you always going to have something to do you're either going to be following up with somebody or reaching out to them or or, or uh, reaching back at some, someone messaging someone sending them invitations you're going to be doing all kinds of stuff and it's going to be it's going to keep you very busy keep you active on social media and you're always going to have something to do as soon as you get on linkedin so Let's get right into it. So first off, when you go to LinkedIn, um, I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do first. All right. So now we go to this profile here. Let's just we're going to start with your profile. Now on your profile, you need to definitely get up to 500 plus connections. Why? Because 500 plus connections just shows that person that you're connecting with, that you know a lot of people, and uh, you have connected with plenty of people. And if they connect with you, then they will probably will be able to go through your connections and connect with other people. LinkedIn is all about LinkedIn, getting linked with someone else. So more connections you have, the more the more influence you will have over that person. Now you might say, well Kayla, I only have 50 connections. That's okay. Start with 50 and I'm going to show you exactly how I built up to 500 plus in just a month. And if you do this every single day, stay persistent, you're going to get up to 500 plus connections in no time. And then another thing you need to do, you need to fill out your whole pro, um, profile. You need to get this profile um, strength to all star. It has to be all star. So that means if someone goes to your page, everything is filled out. I mean, they can pretty much tell everything about you just by just just going through it. They got your skills and endorsement, your education, um, if you volunteer, languages that you know, um, any honors, uh, just different groups and the followings that you have. Now, what I suggest. If you're in network marketing, I suggest you hide all the groups that you are in network marketing because it's not that you want to be vague about it. It's just some people have a negative, uh, a negative mindset to network marketing. And if you're calling people, not well, if you're reaching out to people and they look at your profile and they see a bunch of network marketing groups that you're linked up to. Nine times out of ten, they probably say, "Okay, this guy is probably going to be showing me some network marketing business." I'm not really interested in network marketing business, so they're going to judge you on your page. So just keep your network marketing pages hidden, because so they can't go. They basically when they go to your page, they go to the open mind, so they see your page as you. This is all the stuff that you do, not particularly what you're joined or what you're part of. They can see your following. Most people don't really make a uh, determination of who you follow because they just say okay he's following some great people and some um, influencers so they don't really really make a decision who you follow companies not too big if you have your company on here 
just kind of be uh, be careful with that. But if you have your company, it should be fine. Most people don't really determine what company you're on there. But if you have your company on your profile here as a job or something that your business that you're doing, um, just be very mindful of that because in network marketing, you want to be always in control of the presentation. So if someone, if you have your company smack dab here, and you're reaching out to someone about an opportunity, they're just going to go to your experience, and they're going to click on it, and they're going to go to the website of the company, and then they'll be able to make a decision right then and there if they want to be in your company or not. So I would just keep LinkedIn. If you have, I mean, if it's your business, that's your business. But I would just keep LinkedIn as just your jobs I would just keep it here jobs that you've done or your personal business like this is my personal business that I have that linked off of network marketing that I'm helping other people do now if someone goes to this they're not going to really de they can't determine what network marketing business I'm in I'm, I'm I'm a whole genre of different companies that I can help at one thing so this is my experience this is what I do this is what I love to do is help other people so I'm not actually putting my network marketing company here. You can just see other companies I've worked for at my nine to five. So they can say, okay, so he's been, you know, some experiences in energy. He's been at JCPenney. Okay, so when you reach out to him, they know it's something in sales because they see that you're, you know, you help strategies for business generating leads and stuff like that. And he's seven plus careers in the outdoor sales, but they can't determine what company that is with um, uh, specifically. Okay, so what you'd want to do every single day, so you want to be able to just go to one of your connections. So for one, for example, I'm going to show you one of my messages. We're going to start with messages. You can see all this activity I've got going on here. This is every day. Look, I've got people giving me emails. I mean, I've got emails, messages I'm sent. You can see I've got numbers in here, uh, I, more numbers. The blue is the numbers. More numbers. Um, people reaching out to me. I got a whole bunch of stuff. I got so much activity going on here. I'm overwhelmed by just reaching out to them. But that's good because every day I get on LinkedIn, I can reach out to them. And uh, when I reach out to them, I can get on here and I reach out to them. And then I can catch up or I, I, I don't have to catch up. But every time I get on LinkedIn, it's always work to be done. And then you can always, uh, and I'm going to show you uh, just a routine that you do every single day. And you'll be able to get to all this activity here. You will always have work to do on LinkedIn. And it won't ever get slow. And once it, once you build this up, it will get so fast. People reach out to you. You reach out to people. People say no. People saying yes. It's going to get crazy. All right. So for first thing, you want to just pick somebody. So for example, we're just going to pick, um, we're going to pick her. So we're gonna just pick someone, search someone, pick someone in your um friends. Like for example, pick one of one of your connections and your friends. We start with that. You want to go down to their connections. Connect with someone that is normally used in your business. Now, if you're in network marketing, uh, real estate owners, real estate professionals, brokers insurance agents those are all the people who are in the field as us because they're all in the sales field if they sell a home if a real estate owner a real estate agent sells a home they get paid if an insurance agent gets a policy they get paid and that's all kind of monthly residual insurance is residual income every time that person pays that policy they get res residual income that's what network marketing is. Every time a person, uh, a, realist, a realtor sells a home, they get a commission. So if they don't sell a home, they don't get a commission. If you don't bring in any new partners in your business, you don't get paid. So I, I try to keep it like sales, insurance agents, realtors. So I just go here. Look, I see a broker. Now, broker is definitely just like network marketing because uh, the broker ins um, hires their insurance no not insurance they hire their real estate agents and then every time that real estate agent sells a home that broker gets a, a commission off of that and I just for example if a broker has about 15 agents and five of those agents are selling homes in, on a regular basis he has a recurring residual income of all those agents every single month coming to him and that's residual income so 
brokers is definitely just like network marketing now as you can see it's invite this person just say you're a friend and then you want to send an invitation now what now what LinkedIn is going to do when you send that person invitation depending on what that uh, specific genre or specific job or skill that person has LinkedIn is going to give you a whole bunch of people who are just just like Thomas so what you do this is what you want to do every single day you want to connect with about 50 to 100 people a day you say Whoa, okay that's a lot I know that's a lot and this is how you do it you just want to connect you just want to just keep connecting with different people uh, if they look like someone who you want to like work with you can't don't really judge a book by its cover just connect with people and I'm gonna show you say well can don't you want to read about the profile first no you don't want to read about the profile first you just want to connect with them because why you want to build up your connections up to 500 plus you just want to connect with people in this genre these are mostly um, brokers and let's see Remax uh, real estate agents and I try to connect with people with pictures if they don't have pictures I don't want to connect with it because if I can't see their face then it's probably not it's probably someone who's really not that active on LinkedIn so they probably don't use a picture they just made an account and they never kind of just kind of not went forward with it so connect with people who are on pictures because they mostly most of the time they're con they're active so you just well, you just keep doing this and well, okay this is all you do this is all I do you just connect with just keep connecting with a whole bunch of people and how you know it was about 50 just keep connecting connect about about set a timer five minutes and when that timer goes up I'm pretty sure you probably already already have connected with over 50 people just keep connecting just connect 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 just connect with different people you never want to judge a book by its cover because you never know what this person may have in you know who are what they're interested in you know who are you to say that this person may not be interested in what you have to offer them so it's selfish of you to even look at that person and say hey, look this girl this lady right here she's not going to be interested no that's selfish so connect with this lady you never know that just keep connecting and connecting and once you feel like you got enough connections you're tired of connecting with people then you stop now when you have connected with that person now connections are going to happen here oh as you can see look Rachel is now a connection 12 minutes ago so just for me connecting to all these people I just had someone just connect with me so what you're gonna do once people start accept your invitations on you're gonna do this now if you want a 10 extra day you're gonna send messages to people as they connect with you accept your invitation all day long like if you want to take it to the next level massive action this is what I do every day I take it to the next level as soon as they send me a connection I instantly send them a message and as soon as the next person send me um, and accept my invitation I send them a message now if you say well Kim I don't have time to be doing this all day okay keep it to about 10 to 15 people a day send about 10 or 5 to 10 messages a day this is how you do it. this is what you do so as soon as someone accept your invitation you just click this okay so now what you want to do first off you just want to just glance their profile a little bit see what they have done oh she worked at Golden Corral as a server I used to work for Golden Corral before I used to be in cold choice so I have something that I can actually talk to her about you know we kind of we can probably start a conversation off right there she's like oh really 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 all right so just go glance to their pro uh, profile just go just get familiar with what they do then after that you want to go to content information why because most people people on network on in on LinkedIn their contact information they have a number there you go you have your first lead now what you want to do just copy this lead here I made like a little document or something copy this lead here and I say LinkedIn leads and I would just paste this lead here bam and then I'll just put her name uh, would you say Rachel and then there you go you got your first lead now what I usually do I don't contact these people unless they give me permission unless permission is when I send them a message they reply back to me that's giving me permission to contact them if they're interested now but you can still keep their number here so you have a list that you're building from LinkedIn or if you're a kind of person that's you know what Kayla I'm not waiting for that message there you go just call them there you go you got your first lead 
and most 90% of people on LinkedIn have their number listed so that's leads right there so you can get unlimited people to talk to leads on LinkedIn it works all the time so you just and this is how I, I just create a, create a little word document LinkedIn leads and I put their name and number and I, and I grab this I always see if they have a number if they have the email I grab the email too as well if your person likes to do email campaigns just put that email right next to them or you can put the email right below them just po post that email right there and you're good to go there you go you have their email post it right there you have the email I know this is kinda far away but we'll play around with that later but you can see you have their name and have their email all from a LinkedIn lead so if I want to do an email campaign I could just blast an email off to her right then and there or if the person says they're interested you have the email that you can send their information about your business or opportunity to that email okay so that's how you got your that's what you want to do first you want to see if they have the content now some people may not have a mobile number if they don't have a mobile number there you have to earn it and how you're gonna earn it is by sending a message and when you send a message if they're interested they'll give you the number and I'm gonna show you how to get numbers and I'm gonna show you example of people giving me their numbers and what messages I use as you can see look she's almost up to about 500 connections so you know this is a person that knows pretty much a lot of people so we can definitely get a lot of people and connect with other people through her profile the second thing you want to do you want to endorse them you want to get their attention you want to let them know that you looked at their profile you've seen the skills I'm endorsing them on the skills because you have those skills so that's the first thing you want that's the second thing you want to do the third thing you want to do to the person you want to send them a message now what the message on the subject line I usually do I say Rachel and I say dot 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 can we talk it's the attention getter it works all the time now the message that I send is basically this message I I will go back to here yeah I'm gonna get a close-up for you guys so you can see this is the message that I send every single time and it works all the time up oh, got a little too close I say hey have you ever thought of doing something different? I was very impressed with your profile. I don't normally reach out to people about this, but I, when I saw your profile, it caught my attention. I have an idea how we could possibly benefit each other and work together on a project. Let me know if you're open to that. If not, no big deal. It's great connecting with you. Have a great day, Caleb Johnson. So what I usually do, I just copy paste this and I do this to every single person. This message works 100% of the time. It always works. Any kind of profession, any kind of person, any kind of professional. Now I just zoom back out for you guys and we're gonna go back to Rachel. We're gonna post paste that message right there. Now it looks a little mumble jumbled, but this is what we usually do. We're just gonna fix it up. So where it says I have an idea, I always break this up to this paragraph here. And then have a great day. And then Caleb. That's all you do. And then copy paste this message in here because this message in here is going to actually going to keep this format so when you po paste this again I'll show you guys later it's actually going to keep this format so you don't have to keep spacing all this out every single time so you say Rachel can, can we talk and you want to send that message out and then that's it now like I said what I just did today what I just did got a connection check to see got the lead information here endorsed her send her a message you want to do this if you want to 10 extra day you want to do this as 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 they're coming in like I'm for not like I'm saying as they're coming in look more are coming in man you just connected with me we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna check his contact information oh he's got an email and an address so we're just gonna copy and paste this we're gonna copy and paste all this information here it's not letting me do it uh, separately well together copy and paste this information here what is his name again his name is manual so we're gonna do man you and then we're gonna put his email there and then we're gonna put his number now we have another lead oops we have another lead we're gonna post that paste that there I know, sorry guys, it's kind of all mingled, mingled, but as you can see, it'll be nice and neat. You actually have the name here and then the uh, email address right next to it, but you can see that's one lead, that's two leads. 
there you go so after you collect this information if you want to get the address you can as you can see oh he has 500 plus that's a signature if you got 500 plus you're doing good he has 500 plus connections the next thing you want to do is get his attention you want to endorse him get his attention it lets him know okay you were looking at his page you want to, you're you're you confirm that he has those skills and you're giving him some kudo points and then this is good and LinkedIn this means a lot because if you get this to 99 plus people um, endorsing you it makes your profile even more uh, more um, attractive after you endorse him what we're gonna do send him a message we're gonna put in the subject manual dot 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 can we talk and then we're gonna paste. Oh no, we're not gonna paste his number back to him. <laughs> so we're gonna um, copy this message. Now, since I already copied his name and number, I don't have that copy form of the uh, of the message already saved. So it's gonna be mumble jumble. So just go ahead and uh, just space it out. I have an idea. Make sure this looks professional. So it's like this and then put your name here there you go and I always just copy just in case a person doesn't have a number I can show you an example and then you want to send them this message and there you go like I said if you take extra day as they come in as people are con um, getting your connections as they're coming in you want to just send a message you want to basically get the lead get the information of the lead endorse them send them a message as they come, another one comes in do it again get the lead endorse send a message as they come in get the lead endorse send a message and get the lead endorse send a message you want to do this all day if you can do this all day I guarantee you're gonna have so much activity on LinkedIn it's just gonna be overwhelming and overwhelming is good because that means you're gonna have plenty of people reaching out to you people asking you questions you have more than enough people to talk to more than enough work to keep up um, to keep up with you all right so when you send a message now eventually they're gonna reply back then I'm gonna show you how the message works now I've sent this message to a whole bunch of people and this is the responses that you're gonna get it works all the time guys look for example I'll show you an example I sent this guy the same message have you ever thought about doing something today? I was very impressed with your profile I don't normally reach other people about this but I saw your profile caught my attention as you can see what they reply back I am always open to new creative ideas. Reach out when you get a chance. And I said, awesome, here is my number. What's, what number are you going to call me from? Because I don't take calls from numbers I don't know. I always use a different, that's another technique that you can use. Take, take, take notes from that. That's how I always get someone's number. I let them know that, look, what number are you going to call me on? Because I don't answer numbers. I don't answer calls that I don't know. So I give him my number first. And then what he says, why don't you just give me a call there you go look I got him and I got his number so chat with you soon so look he gave me his number so I have another lead so we're just gonna copy and paste that and bring it up to our our uh, document but we're not gonna do it but I'm just gonna show you an example and I ain't reply back to that guy yet here's another guy I use the same message have you ever thought of doing something da -da 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 -da? he said what's your idea now we said, okay, Cicado, okay, so what's your idea? So then what do you see after that? I'm going to get to that. Let me just show you the people that are responding to show you that this works. It's another one. I said the same thing. Have you ever thought of doing something? Da, 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 da. And she said, hi, Kato, what is it that you have in mind? See, people are responding back. This message works all, works all the time. And this is what I say. Okay, this is what I would like. Remember I said we're going to get to that? This is the exact message that I send to everyone. Anything they reply back, say, what's on your mind? Or what do you have? What's, what's, what are you talking about? I'm interested. I'm always open. This is exactly what I say. Only thing you do is just change the name. You say, hi, whoever you're talking to. Thanks for getting back so fast. I run a company. I got to space that. I run a company here in Maryland. And, I'm, if, what, and you change your state. I run a company here in whatever state you're in, and I'm in the process of aggressively recruiting some talent to help me expand my business. I have a business that can fairly easily help you create what would be equivalent of having two million net dollars invested in a conservative account, earning 5% interest in less than 12 months for the right candidate. In other words, whoever their name is, 
my business or this business pays its representatives on a recurring revenue basis. All right, now what I usually do, I change, if the person's a sales agent, I'll say most real estate agents. If the person says, you definitely want to change this. If the person is sales, I'll say most salespeople. Or, but in this case, I put, I just kept sales because real estate agents are sales. So I'll say whatever the person's um, skill level is or that person's title, put most of them there. So you actually, you actually, you're signifying them and you're getting them thinking, oh, okay, so most people like me, you've talked to or you know they're interested yeah so you say most real estate agents love it because in keep in mind got to keep you know sometimes you you might mess up on the lettering but most real estate agents love it because the income is entirely passive once you build it are you at all open to taking a look at something outside of what you're currently doing if you could earn more to create more free time and now what i usually do I don't like using this on there because you already asked them if their options open here. So take this out. So I'm going to show you another example of what I showed and I didn't use that. There you go. So it's another example. So I just changed the name. Um, so you can see, in other words, Cheryl, the business pays is represented on a recurring revenue basis. Most businesses owners love it. See, business owners, so she's an owner. So I just say business owner love it because the income is entirely passive once you build it. I'll be happy to either drop you an email which outlines my company in details. Works all the time. I sent this to her. I did the same thing I was showing you. I can uh, so I connected. So we go back to home. So what, what, what do we do, guys? Oh, we got new connections. See, look, we got new connections. So what did I do? Uh, Lisa Vernon so we go to Lisa we do the same thing so what did I do I did it Lisa Vernon I checked I got the lead information there's another lead there's more contact information here oh she has 500 plus connections that's good that means she knows a lot of people we can take go through her contacts and find people we know we endorsed her and we're gonna send her a message we do this we just keep doing that over and then when you do that you get to this then they reply back to you and what she say she said what's the project I cannot say whether I'm interested as you didn't indicate any specifics I'm open to discussion a business opportunity that would be mutual beneficial there you go but look she replied back that's the main that's the main objective here and I'll say hi hey, Cheryl thanks for getting back and in this I say the same message what we just said about the two million dollars that dollars that I just read and then she said good morning kid you can either drop me an email or what uh, you can either drop me an email or what and she said you know or what whatever you want else you want to do I said yes I will love I will like some specifics when you get a chance let me see what you're talking about so you go you just say look I'm getting some interest she's interested just from that message even though it's all if you summarize this all up it's network marketing but just from this message she is getting interested and look I didn't even reply back to her because like I said I have so I'm overwhelmed with so many people I got to apply back to but one thing about social media, they never know when you're on, and you never know where they're on. So if you don't get back to someone in like a two, three days, if you don't get back to someone in two or three days, that's okay because you can be like, well, that person might think you're busy and you might not have been on in two or three days, and you can send them a message. So one thing I love about social media, anytime you send a message back, it's never too late. Unless someone said you for them to call you at a certain time. I love it. Now here's a good example. This guy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you some good example. This is the guy that said no. It's not always good. I said that you know, have you ever thought about something? Don't send me. She said, Kip, I would need more details before I can make a decision if I'm interested. Please give me more details. So I sent the same message. Remember the two million dollars, the same message. We keep the same messages. And he says, This is not something I'm interested in. Thank you, but I have to decline. But there you go. You got you, you gotta know. You gotta know on LinkedIn. That's good. More no's you get, you go for no. There's another no. So what do you want to do when you get a no? You just want to, you know, highlight that person. So uh, here's another one I sent. Hey, have you ever thought of doing something different? Da, 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 da. He said, every enterprising mind is always open, but very careful to what? Let's get in touch. My offers are very close to you. Da, 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 da. Oh, look. He gave me his address. I said, awesome. What's your schedule looking like this week? He said, Wednesday this morning. Good. See, I'm going to meet up with him, and I'm going to go ahead and show him my business. So, look, he's reaching out to me just from the same message there. Let's go to another person. Um, what else do we got here? 
Here's another one. Have you ever thought of doing something different? Da, da, da. He said, "Hi, Kara. I would interest. I, I would interested to talk with you about this. Let me know when you are available. Thanks." I gave him my number and I told him when they're available. So he's had to reply back to that. Here's another one. Uh, I said, "Have you ever do something different?" Good morning. Do you do something different? Like what? I've done real estate for twelve, four times for twelve years, and then I told her, and then I'm just replying back to her to get, see what message she reply back to that. Here's another one. Keith, he gave me his. Um, and I'm always see. Look, same message. I'm always open to new ideas. Here's another one. I sent out a message. She hasn't replied back yet. So you can see, I've sent out these messages, and people have to reply back. And uh, there's another one. I got another number. Uh, Caleb, I'm not sure my other message didn't went sure. I would like to talk with you to see what your project's all about. Have a great day. I left him my number. He says sure. And when you can, most of these people have the number in there. So if you just go to their profile, and you go to contact information, he doesn't have a number there. But that's okay. But he's giving you permission to contact him. So you just you know email him, or you can um, just reach out to him. Uh, here's another number. Uh, you see, uh, I said, hey, have you thought about doing something different? She said, hi, Kev, thanks for the email. Sure, let's talk. There's another lead. I'm getting response back. So you can see, as you can see, I'm getting all these responses back from people. This is a whole bunch of people. Um, I haven't even replied back yet because there's just so many people, and I do the same thing every single day. It's just, uh, just, uh, just send, this, send them this message, and they'll always get give me their numbers. And here's another one. I am always, it's the same message. I am always open to new creative ideas. Reach out when you get a chance. I say, here, awesome. Here's my number. What's a number, good number from you to call me from? Because I don't answer calls from numbers I don't know. Now, this is a little little technique that I use. I, I, I say something like this to get the number. I'll say, look, what's your number you're going to call me from? Uh, so I can, because I don't answer numbers that I don't know. This always gets the numbers because it look what he said. Why don't you just give me a call? Here's my number. Chat with you soon. See, look, I just got his number and kind of used a tricky uh, technique to get his number. I just got his number from him. Just I just got his number from me saying that. Look, I don't answer calls from numbers I don't know. So he said, Hey, how about you just give me a call? So there you go. I got another number. So we just add that on to that. So guys, look, if you do this every single day, you connect. Is another connection right here. So what you do, you if they have the number or the email, you get the lead, you endorse, you send a message, and you wait for them to reply. And when they reply, you want to send you want to copy and paste this message here. Just kind of go through the video, pause the video and write and copy down this message if you want to, so you can get this message. Uh, I got it close for you. Just pause the video. And just use the same message. You want to copy this message here. Give this message to them. And when you give this message to them, they're going to reply back with something. Either going to be good, bad, or not interested, or they in, or if they're interested, it gets replies all the time, as you can see. And then once you get the reply back, if they ask you um, what it is, all you want to do is send them this message. What is it that you have in mind? You want to send them this message. Pause the video and copy down this message and, and um, use this message. Once they see this message, then they're going to be like, well, do you have a website? You say, well, well, what's a good email for you? As you can see, she said, yes. I said, no. I, yes, I, I said, yes. And she gave me her email to reach out. So there you go. Guys, this is very simple. If you do this every single day, you're going to have more people to talk to. You're going to take advantage of LinkedIn. LinkedIn is one of my favorite um, social media platforms. Get your connections up to 500 plus by just adding people in the niche that you're looking for. Like what we're showing you, just add, find, go to one of your connections. For example, just go to the connection that connected with you. Go to one of your new connections. Go to, scroll down to their connections. Find someone that looks appealing to you. Senior account manager, connect with them. Send them a friend, say they're a friend, send an invitation. And then all you want to do is start connecting with just people. Just connect with people, different people. Just connect, 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 connect. And once you connect, once they connect, they have connected with you. You want to check to see if they have any information. Write down information, email if they have it. Endorse them, send them a message. If they reply back to the message, then you want to. You know, 
if they reply back to the message what did you have in mind I'm interested you send them this message once you send them this message and you just go about it down the whole nine yards if you do this every single day guys you're gonna have more than enough people to talk to you on LinkedIn you're gonna take over your next you're gonna take over LinkedIn business you're gonna have so many business people business partners reaching out to you you're gonna have fun now the guys this is LinkedIn my daily routine on LinkedIn like like I said guys this is what I do every single day I just do this non-stop if I'm out in the field showing the plan if I get a connection I instantly just send them a mess look collect the lead on my phone endorse them send them a message and then I go through their friends and connect with someone else and then connect 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 and just connect with a whole bunch of people you just keep doing this every single day you have more than enough people to talk to you want to get overwhelmed because people are reaching out to them reaching out to you you reach out to them and it's gonna be exciting and you're gonna build your business on LinkedIn and if you do this you can do this in 30 minutes or 15 minutes or 10 minutes. How I mean, that all depends on how many connections or how many people you want to reach out to. The goal is get overwhelmed by as many people you can talk to. So, because if you get on LinkedIn, you know that you have plenty of work to do on LinkedIn. You can reach out to plenty of people, plenty of people to talk to, plenty of no's, plenty of opportunities for yeses, and uh, you're going to meet so many people. So, guys, this is Caleb Johnson on my daily routine on LinkedIn and uh, if you enjoy this video go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel and you'll never miss another video again now my YouTube channel is right here and you're you will never miss another video again so just go ahead and subscribe to the channel it's right here uh, you can always get training just go ahead and click subscribe if you got value from this video and if you're struggling to find people to talk to shoot over to my website at calebjohnsononline.com and you can get access to free leads now this was a bad example for this video is down now my right now my video this this web page right here is down but just continue to go back to this page in the next couple of hours or next couple of days uh, and then you'll be able to put your information here and I'll give you access to my free webinar showing you how to get free leads uh, just with your library card guys this is incredible now the, the page is down because we're doing construction we're building it a little bit more but the time you see this video this should be up and running and uh, my main slogan is do it now get your leads now uh, build your business have some fun Take care. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Right,